Schools in Riverside County will have to start the new year with distance learning. Today, Governor Gavin Newsom announced that schools can only operate in person if they are not on the state's watch list. Riverside County is on that list. News Channel 3's Shelby Nelson joins us live at La Quinta High School with how district uh, plans on maintaining a challenging curriculum for students at a distance. Shelby. Well, Karen, one key point of Governor Gavin Newsom's address earlier today was being able to provide a rigorous curriculum for students, even if they are having to learn from home. Now, I spoke with all three different Coachella Valley Unified School District districts today, and they all tell me how they're planning on holding their students accountable. Learning remains non-negotiable, but neither is the safety of all of our cohorts of support staff as well as our children. A clear plan for the start of the new school year, at least in Riverside County. Students will be at home learning from a distance. We also want to create a challenging environment where assignments are equivalent in terms of what you would otherwise get in an in-person class setting. A very clear message from the governor to keep up with what students would undergo in a traditional classroom setting. All three Coachella Valley School Districts had already committed to online learning at the start of the year. One of the main challenges now is figuring out how they'll keep the competitive momentum going. The closure was tough and the distance learning that we had in March to, to June is not what we are looking and planning for uh, for August. The transition for schools in March was abrupt, but come the new school year, it's a different story. Students are being held harmless in March. That's much different than now. Now your grade, you will be measured upon what work you turn in. So if you don't turn any work, it will be very hard for us to measure the growth that you are demonstrating uh, throughout this next time. If students aren't turning in work at Coachella Valley Unified, it may be considered an absence. Expectations at Palm Springs Unified aren't any different. New content, meeting students where they are, pushing them forward, really helping them acquire those skills and abilities that they need to continue to progress grade level to grade level. Educators say now more than ever, parent participation is key. It's going to become very important for the parent to work with the teacher when there is a situation at home that they communicate to Together so they are able to receive the instruction that they that they need to get every single day. Now, Governor Gavin Newsom did announce earlier today that the counties will have to stay off the state's watch list for at least 14 consecutive days in order to consider in-person instruction. I'm live in La Quinta, Shelby Nelson, News Channel 3.